Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. The crowd rises for the national anthem of Germany. Quite some performance, and now here comes the response. There are plenty looking forward to seeing this, a capacity crowd here. Well, get ready for some high-grade football, Peter. Two strong teams, as you say, full of wonderful individual talent. And we have every right to anticipate some really entertaining football. As to whether we'll see a high-scoring contest, that's a little harder to predict. I'm not complaining, though, because there are good players everywhere you look around this surface, and that's a fine start in itself. So off we go then. So Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Yeah, Tony Kroos. His passing range is second to none, Peter. He can ping it out to either wing with wonderful accuracy or play a cute through ball into the box when under a lot of pressure. His teammates will be looking to get him on the ball as often as they can because they know how much he can hurt defences. He would be the obvious choice, wouldn't he? He certainly has all the right qualities. It's gone a long way up and away. Keeps everyone guessing. The Cincinnati hits one! Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. Kimmich. Ginter. Tar. Tony Kroos. No goals as yet. Has gone out. He's got options out wide. And the keeper's in command. Arthur. Now it's Roberto Firmino. They try as they might, they just couldn't get into an attacking area. Germany have a free kick. It's a busy front line, uh, lots of movement. And is that working for you? Well. Not really, to be honest, I, I'm not a great fan of taking goal potential away from the penalty box. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. 
Firmino. Felipe. Firmino. And the defence can get it clear. And it's Coutinho. Now it's Roberto Firmino. Chance! Defence has got rid of that. Well read, he sorted that out. Goal now would certainly liven things up. Forward it goes. Goretzka tries to get it forward quickly. Werner <laughs> Richarlison. Well, that is going to be the final action of the first half. So the other team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now. But still goals. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? Unspectacular, but solid, and that solidity could yet be the foundation for them to, to go on and win. No goals at this stage, but certainly not devoid of action. It is nil-nil here at half-time. And we are already promptly back on the way. No score in the first half. Who's ready to go for it now? It's Philippe Coutinho, Richarlison. Now, can he capital up? In with a header! Decent enough try. A more than decent attempt, Peter. Tony Kroos. Brent. Finds himself eased off the ball. And it's Danny Alves. Arthur. Played back in. And here's Roberto Firmino. Kimmich hoists it forward. Oh, he's not played the ball, that's a foul. Werner, it's Werner! The ball's loose, and he's after it. Close with the short one. Gnabry hits one. Werner shoots. Big relief. It just needed better contact. Well, his reaction to that was ultra sharp, Peter. His anticipation is in fine working order. Alan. Firmino is being picked on here. Yeah, and as their most significant attacker, he isn't about to receive any generous invitations. Firmino. And it's Firmino. Goretzka. Werner. Oh, 
Oh, great run. Goretzka! In for the follow-up. It's in! All goals are welcome, but when they come at a time like that, they're priceless. He was so alert to the possibilities there. Great stuff. Oh, Peter, you can't teach that. You either have it or you don't. His anticipation is on another level to everyone else's. Superb. Germany break the deadlock. I think the danger for them now is fatigue. I think when the body tires, the mind soon follows. So concentration is key from here. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Germany have it back and they can go again. And it's Canabry. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Kibik. It's a good foot in there. The final seconds now. Brandt. And the referee brings it to a close. Always in the balance, and in the end, one goal was enough. They are narrowly beaten. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Brazil simply forgot to turn up with an attack, Peter, and that lack of cutting edge could possibly turn into something more serious for them. I think we're just about out of time, so many thanks to Jim, and a very good afternoon to you.